Hi everyone, um, I'm doing a simple hack today. Uh, I'm still working on this uh, uh, clock here. What I've done, remember the the coil that I took out first time when I made a mistake. So I've rewound it, unwound it, rewound it. I got some wires out of it, um, leads. I've half wound it, got the lead, and half wound it again because I want to use this for a future project. But but you know what I wanted to do? I wanted to try this thing to speed up the the army today and to see how it, if, if I could speed up and if it can work. So I have actually done that. I used my um, 555 timer circuit here, which I did some time ago, and I shall place the link uh, in the bottom there. So I'm using 9 volt to, to start this off here. And as you can see, I put a gear there as well. The only thing I can't get it to do is spin round. Uh, it goes back and forward, but as you can see, I put a marker there and it's spinning, spinning around. So I'll just close up shot of that. Oops. Sorry. Where are they? I'll put that gear in there because we can actually see this working. What's happening here is that this is going back and forth somehow, this is moving. This is not actually spinning round. I'm not sure if it would spin round if I put a cover on it to steady it on its proper axis there. But I've got a, oh, you can't see it. I've got this um, pod here, which I can change the speed of this thing. So when I change the speed, it goes slowly. This is about as fast as I can do it there. If I do it any faster, it stops working. Okay, I'm gonna put it down and, and try and video from the top angle there, because it is flat. As you can see that is spinning back and forth there. So if I just, just my pod there. That's slow. It's just that, that arm is just sitting down, resting there. Speeding up now. So if I put the, um, put this back on there, there it works. So here it is, I put the uh, the gear back in there. I can just speed up slightly. As you can see it's only going back and forward. So I suppose you can speed it up if you want to. And I'm only using the coil there, uh, my finger coil there and the circuitry here with the timer and adjusting it by that. So I'm quite pleased with this project. It did take me ages to rewind this coil, uh, guys, but uh, I'm happy with this project. I, I really wanted to achieve this and I couldn't do it before. I wanted to see it working. I'm really pleased with that. So yep, we got it speeding up. It can only go so fast, it can't go any faster than that. I was hoping that it would spin round and round, but it's not doing that. Okay guys, uh, thank you for watching. Um, just to mention the coil now, I've got four wires coming out of it. Don't worry about that, because I separated the windings in half. But actually one wire is going to the negative here, and the other one's, not, uh, the other one's going into where the LED would go. So that's where the on off is going. So that's what's happening here. Thank you for watching. Subscribe. Thumbs up.